stand in the middle of the mat in front of the orange arrow. Perfect. So here is what you're going to do. We're going to give you a sound cue because that's what you respond the quickest to. So when you hear the hop, you are either going to hop out of the way, you're going to slide out of the way, but what you won't do is twist because you don't want to expose your sides to the ping pong. Now uh, keep your elbows tucked in behind the riot shield and the riot shield up between you and the paintball ring at all times. Don't worry about running into the walls, they're padded for your convenience. And when you're dodging to the side, just make sure that you take the shield with you so it's always in front of you and it clears the gong so that way we know that you dodge the paintball. So on the count of three, if I can see a practice dodge, one, two, three. Perfect. There it is, there it is. Yeah, and just make sure you a little bit more over it so that we clear. Yeah, perfect. All right, all right. Okay. How you feeling, Genevieve? Hot. Hot. Oh, hot. Audience, she was a little nervous about this. Can you encourage her some? Yeah. All, right. all right, you ready to do this thing? All right, let's see what happens. I think you're looking speedy, though. You give me a nice dodge there, a little practice. So I tell you what I'll do. I'll fire it at its fastest setting, and I'll just increase the delay from there if you do not dodge that, okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, she's this. All right, here we go. Paintball dodge test number one, only a 0 0.1 second delay. That's equivalent to this being fired, as it is 25 feet away from Genevieve. Here we go. Your sound cue is on. Paintball dodge test number one. Okay? <laughs> but I'm kidding, because that is actually humanly impossible to dodge with a tenth of a second. We just do it because it's funny, and the audience loves to. Guys, give her a round of applause. She played along with Alan. All right, guys, so we're going to give her a little bit more time, aren't we, Brian? Can I do that? Can I increase the delay for you? Yes, She's please, fine. she says. All right. Um, how about I go up to a 0 0.4 second delay, okay? That would be equivalent to this being fired from 100 feet away. If you look at our data board there, you responded at 0.4 seconds. Okay? Well, let's see what we get. Audience, make some noise! Yeah. Yeah. All right, your fans will leave in here. Here we go. Paintball dodge test number two, 0.4 second delay. That's equivalent to this being fired from 100 feet away. closer to the edge of the shield. So I think if you give her just a little bit more time, we'll be able to see a successful dodge. A little more time I can do. Right. I have a suggestion for two other things that might help. May I? Yeah? All right. Here's what I want to do. I want to get your gut involved in the game. I think you just get a little more invested. All right? So if you're willing, I want you to dig down deep, okay? And release a battle cry. That was like a battle giggle. I'm looking for like a battle warrior's yell. Go for it. Ah! Oh, yeah! Let's give her your battle cry. Yeah, you got this battle cry. Yeah! All right. So, I'm going to increase the delay. You got a battle cry. I think one other thing might help, Genevieve. I think if you got a lot more love from your fans. Alright, this time with a 0 0.7 second delay. That would be equivalent to this being fired from 175 feet away. Here we go, Genevieve. Paintball dodge. Test number three. Oh, it's on her shoulder. It's on her elbow there. It's nice catch. Hey, did you get your pop? Yeah, did I do? Good job, did that hurt? Not at all, kid. I'm sorry we provide you with the lab coat. I'll so, take that. <coughs> You should, you should, you should frame this and put this up. All right. Can I, I repeat that one for you? Can I repeat that one? I yeah, think you would have totally dodged it. <laughs> Just it. give me a little, a little more oomph out the way. I love to hear that gong. All right, we're gonna repeat. Paintball dodge test number three. Are you ready? Here we go. Genevieve! So, Mythbusters out there, what does our experiment reveal about our myth that 